Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, we're picking up right where we left off. After picking up that quest to go back to the farm we were at and kill some of those Bloodfang stalkers we saw, well, stalking around. <laughs> uh, not you, Mr. Rabbit Warg. You may survive another day. No, actually, you know what? No, no. No, we saw him. We're going to kill him. Cause mostly just because we want the skins. Yes, see, I'm, I'm sure it is quite content knowing that it died so that I may may further my own progression sli slightly. <laughs> Alright, let's kill all these dudes. Alright, well, now that we actually have some levels under our belt and some uh, decent weapons, these enemies are actually going down pretty quick. Uh, I think I'm still going to keep fast-forwarding through the enemies for now. Uh, if I get any feedback saying you guys don't want me to fast-forward through the fights, uh, I guess I can let them play through it slow at not slow motion, but normal speed. So, uh, let's see. Turn on this quest. Banshee's Queen's voice invades our thoughts. You have avenged the fallen, but there's more to be done. All right. Her voice invades our thoughts once more. Search the nearby farmhouses for aligned stragglers. Keep an eye out for any information that could lead us to Crowley and Bloodfang. So you can destroy all that would stand in your way. All right, I can do that. Oh, they're just it's like right here, too. All right, let's be all sneaky. Scoot past this big old pile of junk. Anything in here? Hello? Anyone home? Uh, are we looking for... Smithers Logbook. Okay. Or Smithers Logbook? Oh, okay. He's a mob that is stealthed. And <laughs> he wasn't attacking us because we were stealthed. So we had to unstealth and then he attacked us. Okay, let's move out here in case he respawns. He won't jump onto us. Right, let's turn this in. What is your status? I have killed the Smithers man and gotten his logbook. Right. The book documents a recent meeting with Ivor Bloodfang. The location is mentioned is Deep Elm Mine. I know of this place. It has only one entrance. We shall corner and crush them. I'm getting lots of experience from these quests. We must act quickly. They mustn't be given the chance to flee. I'm dispatching a squadron of my most powerful troopers to the Deep Elm Mine. I'm also sending the horsemen with them to ensure that nothing goes wrong. Meet him at Deep Elm Mine, east of Olsen's Farthing, and crush those rats. Alright, sounds pretty savage. So it looks like they're just over here, but it is still a pretty good walk. Master Forteski, the horseman. I suppose we're to corner them first and crush, eh? Oh, nice, uh, nice axe you got there, buddy. The mistress has put me in charge of this lot. Our primary mission is to get in there, corner the rats, and kill them all, including Bloodfang. You've done us a solid service and getting the information. Join in the glory and help us drive a sword through their miserable skulls. Oh, it'd be my honor. Let me know when you're ready, and I'll call for the charge. Ready then? Let's get a move on. Try and keep up, Rizotis. Onward, brothers and sisters! That was a very awkward transition. I guess I'll just follow him in. Oh, I totally forgot I had the WoW music turned on. Hey, let me turn that off real quick, because I'm not sure if that's uh, it's flagged or not. I like the music, but better to be safe than sorry with YouTube. <laughs> Bomb! Oh, damn. 
Uh, remember this as the day that Fortescue saved your hide. Now run, get back to Sylvanas. Sure. I, I don't know what happened. They set off a bomb, apparently. It was an ambush. Wow, wow, wow. All right. Back to the sepulcher and to give him the bad news. <laughs> All right, Savannah. I've got some bad news. What joy is there in this curse? What? Oh, she shrieks. Crowley! Bastards! Those were some of our strongest soldiers. I have underestimated Crowley and Bloodfang for the last time. Clearly, they are an enemy the likes of which we have never seen, willing to sacrifice their own to set up a trap like this. Unheard of in alliance warfare. I'll get some new pantaloons. I have no time for games. The time has come to destroy Crowley, Bloodfang, and every dog at their command. To do this, though, we will require cunning and planning, the likes of which they would never dare dream. As one of my most trusted soldiers, I need you to go to the Forsaken Forward Command, located in Gilneas, and report to Deathstalker Commander Belmont. I have sent Belmont ahead with my plans. He awaits your arrival. Didn't we meet a Commander Belmont before? He sounds familiar. Arthur will escort you to forward command. Tell me when you're ready, and I will send you on your way. Alright. Oh, I didn't even get a chance to, uh, go my pants. Can I do them now? Yes, I can. So. I'll snap. More, more Valkyr booty <laughs> carrying us around. So what that, like, impressive arm strength, though. How far do we have to go? Oh, all the way down here. I see. Oh, no, never mind. The, wait, are we going all the way down here? Yeah. Just this is the Forsaken Front, but the quest turn is down here. Hey, we level up because of exploration. Very nice. Let's see what level is this quest. Oh, it doesn't, doesn't tell you anymore, like, what the recommended level is, because I'm pretty sure we're overleveled. For the current stuff, because like the wolves and stuff I was killing were level like 11. We're 17. Although, let's see if I can like mouse over one of the enemies in here. Oh yeah, these guys are level like 13, so we're still pretty over leveled. But we're going to keep with it for the, uh, the sake of the story. Okay, let's get this flight path. We'll talk to Commander Belmont. Well, if it isn't Rizota Snub, oh, he's that guy. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I hope you're ready for battle, because that's all you'll find in this hellhole. We're at the heart of the contested territory, and these worgen mongrels won't give an inch. The Dark Lady has sent you and Athura here for various for a very specific purpose. Before I tell you more, we must make preparations. Head east of the forest of Gilneas and search near the trees and rocks for, of the region for a special plant known as Wolfsbane. Gather as much of the Wolfsbane as you can carry, and return to me. Our mission here goes far beyond the scope of the battlefield. In time, all will be revealed. Hey, he didn't call me Rizotis, Nub. He just called me Rizotis. The madman. <laughs> Is that the only quest we have here? It does appear so. Uh, let us offload all of our junk to Mr. Ang Angelus here. Angelus? Not sure. Oh, we want to hold on to that leather. Get rid of, rid of everything else. Alright. So we need to find six wolf spans, so I guess, you know, six branches is the maximum we can hold with our weak little forsaken arms. Ooh, look at this. I just noticed that we are actually flagged for PvP now. So I guess once we leave the, the zone of Silver Pine. Like basically, Tears Fall Glades and Silver Pine Forest will be flagged for PvP wherever we go. That's pretty cool. 
all that really means. I mean, we're not going to be picking fights really, just because most people our level will have heirlooms. Uh, but we're probably just going to end up getting ganked eventually. Maybe not this episode, maybe not in the next episode, but it'll happen eventually. Please tell me that this guy didn't have a quest for us that we completely skipped. Well, let me let me let me talk to him real quick. Onslaught salutes us. Okay, there's there's two quests here. I don't know how much longer we can hold out for. Crowley and Bloodfang Worgen. Crowley and Bloodfang's Worgen know every hidey hole and safe spot in Gildneas. One minute they're standing right in front of you, and the next minute they're gone. We're going to lose this war to attacks of opportunity, even though we have a superior military presence. But Mama didn't raise no quitter. Forsaken until the end, my friend. <laughs> Head west into the headlands and help out our soldiers on the front line. Kill the attacking Worgen rebels. Okay, so it does look like this guy was despawned for whatever reason, because I definitely didn't see any other quests uh, when I was looking around after grabbing the, the uh, Worgen Spain one. Communications are down with all of our frontline outposts. As of right now, I don't have a damn clue as to the status of our troops in Gilneas. We need to reestablish communications. I need you to head into the headlands and find our outpost on the coast. By now, the soldiers are likely all dead, but their FCD might be operational. Grab the device and get it back to me. Alright, I can do that. Let's turn this in. Did you gather all the wolves, Spain? Why, yes, I did. Takes the Wolfsbane from us. Good. Now just do as Forward Commander Onslaught commands. Try your best to fit it in with the rest of the soldiers. We don't want the Gilneas Liberation Front to get suspicious. Oh, uh, you didn't know they were watching us? Right now, there are five different Worgen spies looking down on our position. Just be calm and follow orders. I'll let you know when we are ready to proceed. Alright, new chest piece. Excellent. Okay, so it does look like we actually didn't, didn't miss this guy. He's just sending us back in there. Actually, no, he's sending us over this way, rather than to the uh, left here. Or to the right, rather. Derp. Our left, but I guess it's 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 east. I don't know. Now let's throw on this new, new jacket. Gives us some more agility, which is our main attacking stat. Alright. Hello there, Mr. Rebel. Or Miss Rebel. You're dead. Uh, yep, this camp is, uh, not looking too good. Alright, let's click on the communication device. Oh, okay, I thought there was going to be, like, some transmission or something. But nope, we just have to grab it and bring it back to the guy. But we have a few more Worgen to kill first. Onslaught salutes us. Alright, we've gone out and we've killed a bunch of the Worgen for you. <laughs> if I could still breathe, I'd let out a sigh of relief. Don't get too comfortable, though. Your mission here has just begun. Aw, oh, and here I was hoping I could go home. I brought the FCD back for him. With this device, I will be able to communicate with you in the field. Now to check out the rest of our frontline outposts. I'm not going to lie to you. What I'm about to ask you to do is suicide. Chance of failure is about 95%. Now ah, we'll be fine. All communications from Dreadwatch Outpost have been severed. With the Worgen constantly rushing us, we have no means by which to get uh, Dreadwatch to check on our soldiers. I need you to head south to the outpost and check on our soldiers. I'll keep in contact through the Forsaken communication device. FCD. 
from here on out. Keep clear of the main road. Okay, apparently that's very important. All right, we have some more junk to sell, right? Yes, we do. Thank you for buying our junk as usual. <laughs> He said, keep clear of the main roads, but I'm a sneaky rebel. Well, Dread Watch Outpost isn't looking too hot either. Well, I mean, I guess the bodies are. They're on fire after all. Dread Watch is lost. This is bad. Real bad. If Dreadwatch is compromised, it means we've lost Gilnea City. Ruh -roh. Our next outpost is Rootsack's Guard, located due east of D Dreadwatch. Make your way to Rootsack while avoiding the Worgen Rushers. You don't want to deal with those monsters by yourself. If you make it there in one piece, look for Captain Rootsack. Just be prepared for the worst. As if there was any other possibility. It's always the worst. Yet another outpost with the guards in flames. Oh, you're alive. Hey there, Rootsack. Why are you cowering, buddy? The... F... After we lost Gilnea City, the port fell. Uh, um, humans are here. Reinforcements from Stormwind. They slaughtered my men. Left me alive to witness their strength, to tell High Command. To tell them that the Seventh Legion are here. Seventh Legion. They rushed us in the dead of night. Their captain barked orders as the submarines slaughtered my men. Submariners. Mariners? Submariners? I don't know. Then he came to me, put his face to mine, and said something I'll never forget. The name's Master Sergeant Pietro Zarin, officer in the Seventh Legion. When you see your soldiers being slaughtered in your nightmares, if you even still dream... Remember my name and tremble. Avenge my soldiers. Kill the Seventh Legion occupying the Cathedral Quarter of Gilea City, southwest of here. Okay. If you can't do it, then surely I can. I wonder if there'll be something in that chest for us. Looks like there's something in it. Probably just clothes. Never mind. <laughs> oh, okay. Another, another quest from the uh, Commander Onslaught. The Seventh Legion are an elite special ops regiment. They've been there, behind the scenes, for almost every major offensive and military engagement the Alliance has ever done. This is bad news. How did they get past our warships? And on whose orders are they here? We need to get our hands on those orders. This Pietro character will undoubtedly have vital information. Find him at the Cathedral Quarter in Gilnea City and take him out. Search his corpse for clues. Okay, well... I think that's a pretty good cliffhanger to end this episode on. Got some epic missions coming up for us. So with all that being said, take care. I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out.